I'm a little bit stuck. You'll notice it's not the same time of day. I did already start recording this episode where I was trying to look for the amulet, but I was just aimlessly wandering down the beach. Turns out that the guy who is from the roots, or the people from the roots, is the guy who's lost his amulet. So I'm kind of stuck between a rock and a hard place, so I don't really know what to do. So in the meantime, um, I'm just going to have to try and do as many other things that I'm aware of. But the only other quests that I feel like are open to us are doing the painting for the architect and getting the big fish from over here as well um, by Mud Willow's mirror. So that's what I'm going to do. Because I don't know what else to do. Because we can't do anything until we get into this little tea drinking cult. <laughs> I don't even like tea. I'm a coffee drinker. I'm a bitter, <laughs> miserable coffee drinker. But if, uh, if the tea let me do Inception, then I would happily drink it. <laughs> so we're going to go back to Lindo. I'm going to make... I was talking to one of you about what might actually allow us to do the correct painting. Um, and so maybe we'll do the painting from up on the little gazebo or something like that. I don't know. So, but I think that the gazebo is the small thing, not the, um, not the thing near the harbour. So we'll try a few different angles, see what we can come up with. We've got like seven inspiration. Another rat! Right. Right, so the gazebo is there. So we need the gazebo, the inn, and this building. Do you know what would be best? So I don't know. Let's just have a look on top of... We could try it from back there, but I feel like he wants everything in the picture. In the painting, sorry. So maybe we... Yeah, but if we do it from back here, we won't get everything, everything in either. Like the inn, I don't think we'll be able to see the inn from here properly, except for like the roof maybe. Yeah, no chance. Well, I mean, I suppose we, we we technically could see it, see all three, but it's very distorted. And the, and the problem is, I'm I'm very aware of the limited inspiration we've got at this point because I'm not really discovering any more new things. So maybe we try it from where we came in actually. Because I think I ruled out doing the painting from back here before because I thought that was the gazebo but if it's that maybe we... can we get on this roof? That would be very helpful. Oh hello maybe we can. Whoa! Come on jump a bit higher. Come on, Oren. See, that would work. Is it too obscured? Obscured? Oh, lovely jubbly. Oh no. Excellent. Right. It was the little thing. A beautiful picture. Paint. Painting, not a picture. <laughs> right, uh, we'll do this, then we'll see about going and doing some fishing. I've got it for you. The painting of my city. Town. It's splendid. Thanks. Truly. Thank you. 
That's all right. I should also thank you for the former. I'm glad you visited me in my town. Yeah, me too, I'd mate. I'd like some time to myself. This is indeed a special place. And I'd like to enjoy it as much as possible before I go. All right, mate. Well, it sounded genuinely grateful. Excellent. Let's follow him. <laughs> Maybe he's going to go up there. Yeah. I love the music, man. It's great. Perfect fantasy wonderment. And the, the little bit of the that flute gives it almost like a Japanese sounding quality. A nice place to ponder, right? Thanks for everything. I need some time to myself. This is indeed a special place, and I'd like to soak it in as much as possible before I leave. All right, excellent. Right, so that's that quest done. At long last. Now, uh, we'll go and see if we can catch a fish. Uh, so we need to head down to the lake near the, where the first folk are. I believe that's where the woman spoke about the fish. Uh-oh. Whoa! Off-road! Everything, all of this is holding up our burgeoning friendship with Bojan. Bojan. All we want to do is hang out on our rafts. And no one will let us. We've got to do favours for everybody. To get this sealant to make my beautiful raft. And then once we've got the raft, we can sail across to the other side of East Shade. Where the windmills are, where that secretive manor is on the lake. It'll be great. I'm not sure how we're going to do this fishing though. Need to cut through here a little bit. Excellent. Hey, who are you? Travelers. It comes. What does? It may be the fiercest East Shade has seen in a hundred years. The signs are all around us. You must find shelter. Can you be more specific? Death. It is death! <laughs> I must go! Be safe, traveller! Tell me! Ignore him. He says that every time it rains. Oh. Stop scaring the tourists, Grandpa! Oh! Have we ever seen it rain? No way! No way! Nice! Am I going to freeze to death? Oh, awesome. We've not had any weather at all like this. Oh, yeah, this puzzle. Oh, it's at the right time of day all of a sudden.
how many mirrors are there? I got it. Oh, Jesus! You finally arrived. Would you like some tea or maybe some pie? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> uh, what? Don't be shy now. Um, yeah, alright. My name is known to all as Mud Willow. My passion is sight and all that it shows. Weaver of light and doctor of eyes. I hold the gift reserved for the wise. Uh, why do you need someone wise? With me lies the gift which everyone seeks. So far, you've all been liars and sneaks. Sought out by foe and drunkards unfit, not one of you has held nearly enough wit. They all bumble in, dreaming of crimes. Every day they show up, it's a waste of my time. But the strings of light you folded and bent prove you've got brains to some extent. <laughs> it seems you may just be clever enough, although I bet your brain is packed full of fluff. But listen up, Painter, yes. for this is your task. Prepare your brushes and hear what I ask. Itself in a constant state of falling, to you it seems that it's always stalling. A stony side where the star hides away, a watchful eye at the peak of midday. When day turns dark but a moment in time, when a star goes black, though everything's fine. The largest of eyes that stare back at you, a sight that aligns, that's the moment I choose. The Eclipse. It's very dark in here, Mud Willow. An eclipse you found, the darkness of an eclipse you found. Darkness of day, but another piece you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. Excellent. Now how do I get out? I just kind of fell onto a breakfast table. So we've got to do a painting of the eclipse. I understand. Oh, great, we've just missed it. Ooh. Okay, um, could I maybe build a tent and sleep in it? No, absolutely not. Let's build a nice tent. Yeah, let's sleep until till ten. Then uh, I can find a nice angle for the painting before the eclipse starts. Oh, I hadn't come over here for this. I come over here for the for the fish, which we'll try and do as well. I guess we can just do it from right here, right? Thank you. 
Itself in a constant state of falling, to you it seems that it's always stalling. A stony sight when the star hides away, a watchful eye at the peak of midday. When day turns dark, but a moment in time, when a star goes black, though everything's fine. The largest of eyes that stares back at you, a sight that aligns, that's the moment I choose. Alright. Easy enough. Let's have a little rest for an hour. <laughs> um, and hopefully we will get the painting just right for Mud Willow. She's the one who communicates with the first folk, right? Right, let's get just about the right angle. I'll wait for the sky to go nice and red. Make a nice big paint. Make a nice big painting. With their lovely, um, I don't know what you call them, like a fuchsia coloured trees. So this is what she actually meant. I can't imagine it's anything else. Oh man. Did I do it at just just about too early or something? I think it looks cool though. Maybe I need to get the whole thing in shot. Maybe I um Wait, where did the door to her place go? Did, does it disappear? How does that work? No, it's not, it's right here. <laughs> Jump into the conclusions, Matt. Uh, yeah, I think we needed to get like the picture of the entire circle. Because I imagine the quest would have updated. Could be wrong. An eclipse you found, the darkness of day, but another piece you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. An eclipse you found, the darkness of day, but another piece you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. Give the sky vision. Okay, so it's got to be at the peak of midday, so I've got to do it bang on 12. I think I need to get the whole thing in there, and there is a chance that I'm massively missing the point here, and it's not just the eclipse that I need to paint. Maybe it's a question of there are very few places that actually... Um, give you a clear view without the mountains in the way, so maybe we need to go to the peak. Oh god, did I leave my bike out? No. Can I pack up that tent? That'd be really helpful. Oh yeah! Oh, that's really sweet that you only have to do it once. Oh. 
Right, so um, maybe we take a balloon ride back up to the peak, camp out in the tent, wait for midday again. Maybe. I just I can't really think of where else there'd be like an uninter uninterrupted view of the um, the eclipse. Or unsullied. I'm not sure what the right phrase would be. Hmm. It's nice to see the rain and everything. I love weather effects in games. Cyberpunk's got some of the best weather effects. Death Stranding had some awesome weather. Horizon did. The Witcher 3. Beautiful weather in some open world games. Alright. I'm not sure we can stay overnight uh, at the mountain top. Wrong. Well, what do you say? Up for a trip to the mountain top? Certainly. This never gets old, Nessa. Skipping this journey is not in the spirit of this game. It's just not. I'll only skip it if the music cuts out on me. I'm not sure if I'll be able to get a clean view from up here, but only one way to find out. whole other world out there. So close, right? So far. The way that this is framed, I kind of feel like the credits are going to start rolling in a second. <laughs> Oh, the music is so good, isn't it? more spectacular than I always dreamed. Feel free to walk around and take in the sights. I'll take you back down when you're finished. Right, so uh, I want get, to get a clear view, so... Uh, there's a hot spring up this way, I think. Now this is a, as clear as we're going to get, man. I'm, in, I'm not allowed to sleep here because it's too cold. Mm. 
Oh man, we're not allowed to sleep here. Yeah, I just don't think you're, you're allowed to sleep here. Alright. Are you ready to head back? Oh god, it just speeds it up. I press space, because we're going to have to come back. Oh, that's awesome. It just does it really quickly then, doesn't just do a loading screen. Okay. Thanks again for all your help. There's nothing so exciting as bringing people on a great adventure. Just let me know if you need another lift to the mountain top, Val. Oh, I will. Right, let's sleep again. Uh, I'm not necessarily sure this is going to work, but... Let's give ourselves enough time to get over there. Right, off we go, Mrs. Well, what do you say? Up for a trip to the mountain top? More spectacular than I always dreamed. Like, just exploring like this always makes me want to try and play No Man's Sky again, but then I remember you have to do all the survival stuff, and then I've changed my mind. That has aged really well. That looks really nice. Yeah, maybe we don't want the balloon in shot here. We just want pure sky, no rocks. Pure sky, I think. Beautiful. Well, thanks for joining me here, guys. Honestly, this genre of game is just something I enjoy so much. The peaceful nature of it. I mean, I wish there was maybe a bit more choice you could do over the styles of paintings but different filters or color palettes black and whites color styles different styles different paint different textures or, or something like that Look, do I have to wait until like bang on 12 o'clock because I'm gonna have to go in the menu for that <laughs> Maybe I need to do it when it's like half there. I'm not sure. I knew, uh, maybe I'm not reading the riddle correctly. Ah, 
I don't think I did it. Well, I'm going to run out of inspiration. That's really nice. Though. Maybe it was just the fact that I needed to do it bang on 12 o'clock. Right, I'm not sure how to deal with this. I'll have to give it one more attempt. Won't have any more canvases afterwards. Are you ready to head back? We'll give it one more try and I'll do it. I won't worry about it looking particularly nice. I'll just do it as bang on 12 as humanly possible. Thanks again for all your help. There's nothing so exciting as bringing people on a great adventure. Just let me know if you need another lift to the mountain top, pal. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> oh dear. I might be missing the point entirely, but... But it, the, the riddle says specifically, at the peak, at the peak of midday. So, I, you know, I probably don't even well, need to. What do you say? Up for a trip to the mountain top? Probably don't need to go all the way over here for it, but why not? Here we are! Even more spectacular than I always dreamed! Okay, we're just gonna watch the clock. <laughs> A sight that aligns. So yeah, it must mean the peak of midday and a sight that aligns has to mean the the, the peak of midday. Uh, sorry, at like at like exactly twelve o'clock is what it means. But how many seconds is a minute here? Is this not actually going to change? No. I have to keep refreshing it. Oh, this is awful. One, two. 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 It's like two seconds for every minute. God, this is going to be tight. I can. I've just got to get the timing right. I don't like this kind of time pressure.
No! That had to be it. God! The largest of eyes stares back at you. Sight that aligns. Uh, so I don't think I've solved it, but... A sight that aligns. Not sure. Are you ready to head back? I was sure that it was going to be the midday thing unless I mistimed it. I think I did it just about right. I mean, they, they must have given you a bit of grace, like a minute either side or something. But, um, I don't know. Thanks again for all your help. There's nothing so exciting as bringing people on a great adventure. Just let me know if you need another lift to the mountaintop, pal. Oh, I will, my friend. All right, let's just check in with her in case it's worked. I can't imagine it has. It'll be like the other quests. It'll update when I get it right, but... It sucks to waste, because it's a riddle, right? It really sucks to waste inspiration on it. <laughs> yeah. Would this have been locked if I wouldn't have solved the riddle? Probably. Hey, I'm sick of your riddles. Just give me the prize. I deserve it. I've made three beautiful paintings. All for you. An eclipse you found, the darkness of day. But another piece you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. An eclipse you found, the darkness of day, but another piece you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. <laughs> An eclipse you found, the darkness of day, but another piece you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. So does, she, does that mean she wants, like, when it's a crescent, like when it's partially eclipsed? Is that what she means? Must be what it is. How much inspiration? I've got three inspiration left. This is really upsetting if I mess this up. Find me and so so that what she's saying in there is different than this. An eye. Is there anything else that could play into this? It must just be when the eclipse is on its way and it and it's like winking. Right? Alright, last attempt. I can't believe I've done this again, man. We just helped the architect and now I do this nonsense all over again. And what happens when I've got no inspiration left and I can't progress the game? I think what she means is a partial eclipse.
So I'm going to wait until it's like halfway across and just pray. bit more. Did that not use any more inspiration or am I going daft? I think it did. Maybe it didn't. I'll have to check the footage back. I can't remember how many I had, how much I had. Right, obviously that didn't work. But... Oh dear. The darkness of day, but another piece you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. Give the sky vision. You can't paint while you're on the balloon. An eclipse you found, the darkness of day, but another piece Peace. you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. I am a fool. Just like the people she described. A hopeless dullard. With no intellectual prowess. An eclipse you found, the darkness <laughs> of day, but another piece you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. Oh right, we need to look at the thing through an archway then. An eclipse you found, the darkness of day, but another piece you've lost on your way. Search the landscape and find me an eye. Give the sky vision, then you'll have your prize. Okay, so, right. So it needs to be the eclipse, but it needs to be the eclipse seen through, like, an archway or something that that's like an eye socket or something. Uh, okay. That, that has, that's the only thing I can really think of. Right, an archway. So I guess we go to Narva for that. An eclipse you found! Maybe from the top of the, the the library, if there's loads of archways, maybe. Hmm. I don't know, man. This doesn't feel like it's gonna work. Where's there an archway view? 
Get out of the way, you fools. I'm sorry, I'm getting aggressive. Something like that, or... Find me an eye. I'm not going to do it now, obviously, but... Right, guys, I'm just going to end the video there. I'm going to go back to the footage and just check if... I used inspiration to paint over. I don't... I, I'm not sure if I did, but... Um, I might have done. How many paintings did I do? I had seven at the start of the video. We did the one for the architect, six. And then I did, what, five, four, three. Yeah, so I did use one. What, did I? How many did I try? One, two, three, and then four, because I painted over one. So yeah, I did use inspiration. That really sucks. Never mind, I'll, I'll have to have a think about it, maybe chat to you guys. So, if you like, if you enjoyed the video, guys, and just remember everyone never trust an on the I'll see you next time.